Margarita se cura de botín okay. Cuando visita a su, su abuela Si necesita una amiga Debe hablar con un ratoncito Si quieres ser mi amante Debe ser alta y delgadita Lunes, martes, hey. Ratones, hey. Miércoles, jueves hey. Todo, todo hey. Lunes, martes, hey. Ratones, hey. Miércoles, jueves They just fall to pieces. I mean, look, there's all crumbs going everywhere now. Oh, I'm covered in crumbs now. Oh, crumbs, crumbs, oh, crumbs. It's Ascension Day today. I wonder why this was on the radio. Always oh, sitting on things. Yeah. Claramondi and Dolores, don't they look nice in their Chinese palace gowns? Because so pretty. Very nice. Got the dragon. Because we've got our two girls in their lovely Chinese princess outfits. Don't they look good? Well, I think so anyway. Oh, I'm sure Dolly lovers would like. They look so pretty. There's Clarimondi. In her one, though to be honest with you, I thought this looked better on Lucinda. And there's our lovely Dolores in her one. I had Dolores in mind when I got the green one. Of course, I think it would suit Grace because she's our green girl. But probably well, she'd look like she was in fancy dress if she was wearing a Chinese costume. And it wouldn't look right on her. I did try it on. The dress light, though, the evening dress that's underneath, because it's a nice dress as well. But these girls look like they're meant to wear them, of course, because it suits them. But uh, this this one looked really good on on our Lucinda as well. Where is she? Oh, it looked good on her as well. So I've, um, I'm so very impressed with a lot of the things from the Chinese sellers, as I've said. On this nice little, like, Alice-type dress on Maya here. Um... Of course, Susie, our Susie wanted it, but she's got the pink one, and Grace has got the yellow one. Oh, Susie. She's still in Alice mode, because she goes into Alice mode when she wears things like this. And she's only okay as long as you refer to her as Alice and you don't upset her. And you must remember that she's Alice. When Alice and she's very right and proper when she's like this but she's very covetous of this blue dress she said it suits her better she said it doesn't fit Maya properly it's too small for her it isn't really it's just a bit of a snug fit round the top and, and Susie it suits, Maya said you can borrow it Susie <laughs> oh dear so she's she knows she can borrow it but she 
She wanted me to give it, if she, she couldn't have it, she wanted me to give it to her sister Lorelei with a blue hair streak because she knows anything Lorelei's got, she can just take and wear herself. But um, when I get something more suitable for Maya that's blue and matches her tattoo, then um, Susie can, or uh, Susie and Lorelei can have it. But it's not really Lorelei's style. She's, um, all the dollies have got their own individual personalities. She is Lorelei. And um, she said, I don't really want to wear things like that. But she can try it on. After all, that would suit your blue hair streak. It would match. Yeah. Anyhow, let me continue with, I'm digressing. Let me co continue with the lovely haul I got. Lovely haul from Waitrose. A bit dark, a bit of a dark overcast today. Um, oh, I got these from the independent health food store, not for me, from my friend's birthday. It's his birthday next week. And I also, I thought I got him some of these to try as well, because he's always wanting things like wild pink salmon and vegetables. That other one was tuna and pasta. And I've got a new variety to try myself, which I haven't tried before, pasta and vegetables. And, uh, oh, another tuna and pasta. Anyway, let me show you the lovely Waitrose. The lovely things I got from Waitrose. The lovely utensils and um, nice colourful... Oh, I'm getting a bit warm. One minute it's hot, the next minute it's cold. Try not to rustle too much. Oh, no, the picture's gone. I must have touched the computer. The picture's gone. I've got a white screen. Oh, come back. I, believe, I can just about see we're still recording. It's flashed, flickering. But I need to make sure we're not too washed out. I'll just put that bag back. What's this? Oh, Bon Mama Crocant. These are coconut, small coconut biscuits. They're not as nice. They're harder as well. They're not as, they're not as nice as those lovely Dean's coconut biscuits that I got. Anyway, these are from Waitrose. Aren't they pretty? They're so pretty. Hang on, the radio is going on. No. Pretty. Look at butterflies on. Very nice. Pretty. reason was they've got some really nice things in Waitrose at the moment. I didn't intend to spend so much yesterday. I normally only, I've got chocolate curls. I normally only get food there but they had so many nice things, so many nice items yesterday. Waitrose home. Now this is I presume a salad, salad bowl with tray but um, I, I thought of, you know, there's storage. I always need storage containers and a nice tray because I like this pattern. I've got a little a plate with that. I love this pattern. I think it's so pretty. Oh dear, we've got reflections, haven't we? That isn't our better. Not. I've got to talk non-stop with the music in the background, otherwise I get a copyright claim. And it's really, really annoying. The worst one was these people who call themselves a young HUD, and they're, they've taken a piece of music which was provided free for anyone to use on YouTube, and they've claimed copyright on it for themselves, even though they're not supposed to. And then and they're claiming copyright on anyone using the original. And I disputed it, but they wouldn't accept it. And I'm really, I don't know what to do about it. I'm really annoyed. I'm not going to give them my full contact details. These people, strange, complete strange, not strange on the internet. I don't trust them. Anyhow, these nice little trays. Because I thought YouTube dealt with the disputes themselves like a media, but they don't. They leave it between you and the people who are falsely claiming copyright. And then the people who are falsely claiming, you've got to give them your full contact details. And I don't think that's right. So YouTube doesn't care at all about, especially people that's, whose channels are not monetized, so they're not making anything from it. I've found so many things going wrong with my channel. I can upload a video and when I go look later it says private video even though it's not. It's been published. Anyhow, I don't want to go digressing about other matters. These nice 
lovely set of plates, like the lovely colours. That's the colour that, that Care Bears I got should have been, the bedtime bear, and he wasn't. He was like a bright turquoise instead, which I don't mind because I love the colour, but I thought the, the Care Bear bedtime bear is supposed to be this sort of, like a dusky blue. And these, they're so pretty. And they're melamine, they're not, um, you know, china that can get broken. Now, that's my favourite pattern, the one with the lovely butterflies on. So pretty. And one also, oh, I got these lovely green, shades of green, verd, verd, verdant or something. Like that. Well, that means green, doesn't it? They're all different shades of green. You know, I love green. See, they're different. Different shades. I'm not so keen. All nice different shades of green. I'll try and show them all together. I'm always reluctant to try anything because anything I try and do, something goes wrong, or they fall down and break something. So I, I have to. There we go. You can just about see those there. Oh, sorry about the noise. I got two of these as well from the health food stores because they're they're quite nice. I used to like the vanilla flavour one best, but they don't do that anymore. I also got this Salt Pro custard. I know it seems a funny thing, but that's just for my friend as well. <laughs> for, um, I bought him quite a few things for his birthday. I, and I got this as a can candle holder. I love the colour green. Such a pretty colour. So nice, that green glass. And Waitrose, this is from Waitrose. This came from a... Yeah, that was from Waitrose as well. So, And this is from Waitrose. These came from a, an independent health food store, so I'd like to get things right. <laughs> So pretty, look at it, isn't that lovely? Oh, that's so pretty, it's a lovely colour. That looked nice with a candle in there. I really knew the cart selling Maybelline now. The macaroni cheese. Oh, Bodies in a bag, naked dollies. I thought it's about time these saw the light of day. Clothes for the male ones, so they have to be naked. <laughs> oh dear, funny. Of course, they all get up to all sorts later on when the lights are go out. Oh, whatever's going on here? <laughs> They're just there for their hair to dry. <laughs> China, they came. <laughs> oh, this does look rather <laughs> suspect. <laughs> level playing field. One more on this Julian and uh, I haven't known these yet. Hey, good afternoon, good afternoon. So he's got the dressing uh, gown on. He looked uncomfortable, stood there with nothing well, yeah, on. He was cold. <laughs> Mm. 
Oh, look at the hair colour. It's lovely. Made by Hasbro, Disney Descendants, Evie. I'm not familiar with um, that, and I'm not going to call her Evie, because I've already got a dolly called Evie. Evie and Ivy, the two twins, my Mycene dolls. And um, so I don't want two dollies called Evie. And of course, I know in real life you always meet people who... So I could have Evie 1 and then Evie 2, but no, I'm not, I'm go I should call her something else. I should think of something. Pretty. I don't like that cape thing, but I should take that off. Oh, hello kitty. 60 pound. Oh, it's porcelain now or something now, isn't it? Lovely, and the shop's closing down. Dear. Another shop closing. That's so cute. Oh, pastel shade. Do you know what I like my pastels? So pretty. Hello kitty. They've always got their heads on the wrong side, haven't they, Louise? than they usually are. Look, I can't resist. I had to get her, she's so pretty. Now, I know I said I wasn't going to start collecting sparkle girls, and I'm not, but I shall if any take my fancy, and I do rather like them. and cream. Oh, they're lovely. They are lovely. Ooh, delicious. Oh, they're dark, nearly. <laughs> oh, I can go fast. Oh, I've been playing Frankie Stein doll, putting some stickers, uh, some of the sticker things that came with her and trying her different outfits on and all they were a problem to get on and off the, the dresses they make for them this one does at the back but the other ones that come with her um, they don't and you've got to put them off and on and their hands are too well here's the dresses and there's there's no closures on them. They just you just have to slide them off and on. And um, I'm wondering if they're going to fit my clone liquid charm doll that's smaller. I'm not going to draw on them with tapes, the tips that came with them. Here's Candice in the silver outfit that I guess a Steffi Love outfit, and it's on her for now. I don't think I'm going to leave it on her forevermore. Just a quick warning, I've probably mentioned it in my last video. These leather look dresses that are, and trousers or uh, leggings that are for sale on eBay, they look very, very nice. But you've got to be so careful. When you stand the dolls against another one, look, it's left a, a black mark on Bronwyn here, uh, that's his, his Bronwyn, it's left a black mark on her face and I cannot get it off. I've tried, um, I've tried nail polish remover, I've tried hand cleansing gel, face wipes, soap, 
Um, hydrogen peroxide, nothing works. I understand that benzoyl peroxide, 10% benzoyl peroxide works, but even then I think it might take months and I haven't got any anything with benzoyl peroxide in. I believe it's in ac acne treatment or whatever. Anyhow, I know I showed these already, but I thought they looked so nice and they're Chinese palace dresses, Clarimonde and Dolores. But let me... There's some of the stencils that came with her. Frankie Stein. Oh, there's elastic hanging from it. I got this from Boots just because it was cheap. I'm not keen on the smell of musk. And also, I know I probably not derived from the real animal, but they torture animals to get that. I got this from Poundland because I always need things like that. I'm looking for. I got a My Little Pony yo yo. I used to be quite good with yo-yos. I used to have a glow-in-the-dark yo-yo. Somebody get oh, it's called glow-yo or something. I haven't seen one of those for a long time. I'll be open this and I'll be back. Right, here's the uh, My Little Pony. That's cute, isn't it? Different design, both sides. I've got a massive, massive, massive haul from just one afternoon and evening from yesterday, Saturday, in um, TK Maxx, but mainly, mainly Asda, and um, just a few things from TK Maxx, and nice things, but Asda mainly got some lovely things, and um, but I should do a separate video without me enough time, or this one would be uh, too long. Let me see if I can do this. I used to be quite good at yo-yos. I haven't touched a yo-yo for a very long time. Oh, and then it starts to, uh, no, and then it starts to, especially when I know I'm being watched. Let me try again. Oh. I'm one of those people, always better doing things when I know that nobody's watching me. As soon as anybody watches, it all goes wrong and they say, oh, she's useless, she can't do anything. And then when I'm on my own, I can do it fine when there's nobody watching. Oh! oh. <laughs> oh, right, okay. Now it's going oh, wrong again. Let me just try one more time. I don't even know if I'm in the right place for anyone to see it because, um, very really inadequate circumstances here, but we're going into all the details about that. Let me try. Am I actually where I can be seen? <laughs> uh, we're, we're twisting. Okay, that's it for now. <laughs> right, I'm going to eat some of this edible soil in this Heston egg. Look at an arse in both of them. I mean, I need three hands for this. Mmm. Mmm. I've used all the eggs. I've used all the mini eggs that were inside. Hmm. Mmm. Mmm, it's so lovely. Mmm.